Cyrano is a man who's a poet who falls in love with a distant cousin of his and realizes they can't be a couple because she's in love with someone else and he ends up creating a possibility that she might fall in love with his poetry. The love triangle will be something really very, very recognisable to everyone. We've been very lucky in casting this show with seven brilliant performers, all of whom are familiar with this theatre that we're in now and the unique things you can do in this theatre when you're telling a story. This is the perfect space to play a piece and a story like Serrano. It's all about the audience coming, the expectation. It's about people seeing each other in, in a space like this, whether it was the audience, and it's about a love that grows from being in a theatre. I had a really strong sense that I wanted to create an image of beauty and love that can only be reached for and never really touched. There are two different kinds of scene painting going on. One is for the proscenium arch area of the design and also we have a series of sky cloths. The set will be actually quite minimal, leaving a lot of space for imagination for the audience. Lots of the cast have worked together before, so there's lots of bouncing around, lots of um, inventiveness a certain amount of clowning. The nose is such a key element to the character. But really the ugliness of the nose is the way in which it makes him feel. It makes him feel as if he doesn't deserve to be loved. If people come and see this show, feel something, and go away thinking about love in their own lives, then I'll be happy. I hope that everyone will come with a like, strongly beating heart uh, and with the flag waving like, I know now that I will say I love you and I won't be scared about it. <laughs>